Hey everybody, One Life of Battle here, or CJ. So, in this episode, it's episode 21, I think. Um, I just wanted to let you guys know that uh, somebody left me a comment to nickname my Jolteon, and apparently uh, they kind of agreed to the name that I was going for. So, we're going to go with the name Jolt. As you can see, one of my subscribers by the name of Tony Cuevas. I think that's how you say her last name. She actually left me a comment saying, you know, that's an easy one, just name it Jolt. Let's be honest, that is pretty easy and it sounds pretty badass. So, we're gonna go ahead and nickname him Jolt. In the meantime, I uh, went ahead and defeated the, uh, the Pokemon Tower, I think that's what it's called over here. I, just, I took that down. Let's see. Cinnabar Island. Burn Desire. Okay, yeah, I took down this Pokemon building. Uh, I got the secret key to get inside the fire gym. I went ahead and took down all the trainers ahead of time. And then we're gonna go, we just gotta come back and defeat Blaine. So let me go ahead and fly to, fly to, I think it's Lavender Town for nicknaming my Pokemon. Let's see. Let's check it out. So I think it's this one. No, not this one. I know it's underneath Mr. Fuji's house or something like that. I think this is the guy. Hello. Hello, hello. I'm the official name raider. Hell yeah. So let's do it. Want to rate the n nicknames of your Pokemon? Yes. Which Pokemon should I look at? Jolteon. Jolteon, is it? Hmm, that is a decent nickname. But would you like to like me to give it a nicer name? How about it? Yes. Fine. What should the name, what should we name it? Let's call it Jolt. As you can see, you guys actually uh, screenshotted the comment and put it in the video so that y'all can see the, her nickname for the whole video. Okay. This Pokemon has renamed Jolt. Shout out to you, uh, Tony Kubas or Cuevas, however you say it, for giving me the nickname. For the Pokemon, and now I am nicknaming it right now. That's better name than before. Hell yeah, old man. There we go. His name is now Jolt. Hell yeah. Let's do it. I never noticed this. What is that? Speed is 119, and his special is 107. That's insane. Oh shoot, go back. Okay, let's uh, fly over to Cinnabar Island. Take on the gym leader. Oh. My bad, I gotta get outside the building. But yeah, I don't have my brute with, with me because obviously the Cinnabar Gym is a fire gym and I can't use a grass Pokemon at the fire gym, so that's why. Cinnabar, let's go. Let's do this. Alright. As you can see, I have my Lapras up front, or her name is Jessie. And we're going to be using her to take down Blaine, hopefully. We'll see how that turns out, right, you guys? Oh yeah, there's actually questions here for you to answer. In case you don't want to battle these trainers, you can actually, like... And they're actually old questions, so look. Pokemon quiz. Get it right, and the door opens to the next room. Get it wrong, and face a trainer. If you want... If you want to conserve your Pokemon for the gym leader, then get it right. Here we go. Caterpie evolves into Butterfree. Yes. Alright. You're absolutely correct. Go through. Okay, let's go on through. What the hell? Okay. Yeah, and they have some funny questions here, like... They have a question here that's something about Eevee, I think. Let's see. Pokemon quiz, get it right, and the door opens next to it. Get it wrong, yada yada yada. Okay. Let's see what it says. Here we go. There are nine certified... Pokemon League badges. That's a no. There are eight Pokemon badges. Absolutely correct. Go through. Okay. Let's go. Alright, let's check this next one. Pokemon quiz, yada yada, get it right, yada yada. Okay. Let's see. Keep in mind, these are old episode episodes, so let's see. Oh, shit, I answered it. You see, it asked if Poliwag had three evolutions, and technically he does, but in this generation, he doesn't. 
So in this generation, he only has two, which is Poliwhirl and Poliwrath. The only two evolutions. Whereas in the other games, he actually has three, which includes uh, Politoed, I think. So let's see what this one says. I'm just gonna do one more, and then I'm gonna go take on the gym leader, so that way I can I don't have to waste everyone's time in this episode. Are thunder moves effective against ground elements? I'm gonna say yes. Ah, I got it wrong. Bad call. I know it's I know it's uh it's not effective against ground side, but oh well. Take on this gym leader. Ha ha! I am Blaine. I am the leader of the Cinnabar Gym. My Fury Pokemon will incinerate all challengers. Oh, that sounds creepy. You better have a burn heal. I really don't have a burn heal. I just noticed that, so kind of fucked it about this one, I guess. He has four Pokemon. Growlithe? All right. Let's go, Jesse. Surf. Super potion. He just tried using a super potion, and his Growlithe is already fully healed. I don't, I don't understand that. He just <laughs> super effective. Bonita. All right. Surf. Bonita used fire spin. Attack missed. Just to use Surf. That Surf attack sounds so creepy. Super effective! Oh, critical hit, okay. And super effective, okay. Just got 1,300, and he's, she still didn't level up, okay. Rapidash. I'm a little scared of that one, I ain't gonna lie, you guys. Fire spin. Shit. Not very effective, can't move. Attack continues. Sorry about that noise, you guys. I actually have a fan on in my room because the... the why, did, why did you try using the Super Potion again? Anyways, I have a fan on in my room because the uh, maintenance guys that were fixing something and they needed to have the fan on all night, so I've had the fan on this whole time. Super Potion? Oh, I shouldn't have used Body Slam. Hope I paralyzed that. Oh, dude, what did I do that for? Oh, man, I'm so stupid. I'm sorry, Jesse. Can't move, that's fine. That's alright, Jesse, you're gonna be fine. Why did I just use it again? Probably never gonna move if he keeps landing these fire spins. Come on, try using a super potion again. Surf! Yep, I'm probably never gonna be able to move, you guys. I'm stuck here. I kinda wanna skip through this. Yeah, you know, I'm not gonna skip it. No, 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 I'm not gonna skip it. I'm not gonna skip it. I'm just gonna use a potion on my Pokemon. Oh, shit, all I have are... I've been all my fresh waters, man. Alright, we're using a uh, hyper potion. I know I shouldn't have used it that early. I know hyper potion comes like 200, but... I don't want to take any chances, you guys. No, go back. But I have a lot of surf still. Hey! They missed. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, you guys, if, if you want to use a really, really good water type in this game, I highly, highly recommend using the Lapras that they provide you in this game. It is definitely worth it. There we go. Arcanine, level 47. He looks like a scrunched up beanie baby. <laughs> Oh, you know what? I should've used Confuse Ray, but I think I should be okay. He's literally, like, 11 levels higher than me. Shit. That's alright. Arcanine use Ember. Even if he burns me right here, he just might die from this Strike Attack. So, dead anyways. Good fight, Arcanine, even though you're a really great Pokemon. From what I'm understanding, apparently, from what I looked up, like, I guess history on uh, the older Pokemon games, apparently back in the day, Arcanine was actually known as a legendary, the original legendary dogs 
One of the legendary dogs from back in the day. Heightens these special abilities every Pokemon. Here you go too. Live for Steam TM38. I think it's Fire Blast. Yep. Nice. Charmeleon or Ponita would be good bets. Thank you. Uh, I don't have a Charmeleon, and I sure as hell don't have a Ponita or a Rapidash. So, but yeah, apparently from what I look from from what I looked up in the past, apparently um, Arcanine was originally known as one of the one of the like he was originally supposed to be one of the legendary dogs from back in the day, which is pretty crazy to say the least because. Arcanine is a really strong Pokemon. He's a really strong, uh, um, like, a uh, dog Pokemon. Um, he can learn moves like Extreme Speed and, and like, his fire, his special abilities on fire attacks are super, super, super strong. And his offensive attacks are really strong too, so... Originally, Arcanine was supposed to be a, uh, a legendary Pokemon. But they obviously made the real legendary Pokemons, which was... Uh, Suicune, um, Raikou, and Entei, which were, those were the three original legendary, those were officially legendary dogs. Anyways, I'm gonna end the episode off right here, you guys, thank you for watching. Um, uh, one more shout out to Tony Cuevas, or Kubas, who left a comment of nicknaming my Jolt, or my Jolteon, so you now officially have a Pokemon in this, in my Pokemon named after, or nicknamed after you, so... Shout out to that. Other than that, uh, I'm going to end the episode off right here, you guys. Uh, please, please, please hit that like button and show some respect, show some love, and get some views on these channels. You know I'm doing all right. Episode's doing great. Uh, see you guys later. Bye.